Good morning. Today we're going to get your Easter pictures taken. So this is the first time that he will have met the Easter Bunny. We didn't do it last year. Right? So this year you're gonna be a big buddy and meet the Easter Bunny. Yeah, so we're going to the Mall Millennia and it's gonna be pretty interesting because they, yeah. they have all kinds of protocols in place for COVID-19. Mm -hmm. So he doesn't get to sit on the Easter Bunny's lap. We have to go in one parent at a time, I think. I think, no, I think we can, we can both go in. Oh, okay. But I think if we, there, there was something like if you wanted extra people in your pictures, you'd have to pay extra. So we'll tell you more about it once we get there as far as pricing goes. But um, the thing that I think that is good about all of this is that this is kind of like a good way to dip your toe in to, because normally they would sit on the Easter Bunny's lap. Yeah. And I think that might scare him. Well, maybe. So this, this is a good way to just like, here's the Easter Bunny. And then next year, like remember the Easter Bunny? Now yeah. this year you can sit on his lap. So I'm excited to see how this goes. So let's go give it a try. Yeah, I also wanted to show you his outfit because he looks very cute. Look at this buddy's cute outfit. You look like a look like a little lumberjack hipster. Say, Daddy, this is what I'm gonna wear to meet the Easter Bunny. Yeah. Oh. Ooh, he's you like, look pretty Bye. cool. Oh, he's ready. He's like, let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> here we go. We have no idea where the Easter Bunny is, so we're here a little bit early. We're gonna try to find him. So I didn't realize it, but there's so many like new restaurants here. Yeah. Earl's P.F. Chang's has been here, I think, but Capital Grill, I think, is new. And Cheesecake Factory's been here for a while. This is where we ordered all of the cheesecakes when we hit 500,000 subscribers. Do you guys remember that? Yeah. We had cheesecake for like months. Right? <laughs> Ooh, what kind of flowers are these? I feel like they're chrysanthemums. So pretty. Yeah. This is what we call the fancy mall. I think this used to be a fountain, but I think it splashed too much, so they turned it into a planter. Is this just a Louis Vuitton pop-up? It looks like a giant box bag. It's got little clasps on it and everything over here. And they do have their own store. So yeah, yeah this would be like an extra. They have two stores here. They mm -hmm. have a Louis Vuitton men's oh, and yeah. just a regular Louis Vuitton. Is it open or is it just a giant box? Oh no, it is open. Yeah, weird. So we found out that this Louis Vuitton pop-up is like a specialty pop-up where they're showing one of a kind bags and it's traveling around the US. So it seems pretty interesting. We did also want to show you that there are a couple of family restrooms down here as well as a nursing room and baby changing station. Yeah, so it's like a nice big changing table over here and a comfy couch to nurse on. Wow. wow. Mm. That's really nice. All right, on our way up to the second floor because that's where the Easter Bunny is. I like, you know that it's a fancy mall when they're like, keep your kids away from the doors. We don't want to be cleaning up handprints. All right, we're going to meet the Easter Bunny. I don't, is the Easter, the Easter Bunny's not here right now. Ooh, yeah, I like the little archway and everything here. Yeah. Well, so is this snail over here. This is so interesting. Huh. Okay. So, just so you know, you do need to make a reservation to come and see the Easter Bunny here. Also, here's the pricing for the instant packages for $25. It gets you two 5x7s, one 5x7, plus four wallet photos, two 3x5, plus four wallet photos. So, you gotta select one of those or you can do for $45 a candid portrait session. This is called the Orange Food Court and you can tell why they've got some fake orange trees out here. Also, we're about uh, 20 minutes early for our reservation with the Easter Bunny, so. We are very excited. <laughs> we're gonna come back. We're gonna like do a little bit of like window shopping and then we'll come back. I'll tell you what, I was very disappointed when I found out that Vince was not a offshoot of Vinnie Camuto. Oh, it's not? No, two totally different places. Oh, really? Yeah. I didn't know that. I did also find out that Vince has a way that you can like rent clothes though, which I thought was very interesting. Oh really? Kind of like Stitch Fix, but uh, like if you don't like them, you send them back. It's like oh. rent, you rent them. Weird. I'm a, I'm a bit suspicious of this store. I feel like aliens are running it, right? What is this? It's called Out of This World. Oh. An interactive imagination immersion above and beyond. Oh, so it's like an experience. Oh, so store. it's like the void. Oh, is it? Maybe. It seems like it would be, right? No. Probably not, though. It's probably just gonna be like a playground. Going into Gap Kids. Ooh, got some Star Wars stuff in here. Well, Mandalorian shirts. That's fun. Have some like Mandalorian streetwear here, too. How much fun is this? And this is $50. Oh, yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> too cute. I am. That is, he doesn't talk like that. I know. But this is just Yoda. 
Oh, okay. Not Grogu. Okay. They have Easter Star Wars pajamas. Super fun. I love this. That's like the most fun jacket I've ever seen. Oh, and this NASA. Fun fact, this logo is called the Worm. Oh yeah, look at that. That's nice. Yeah. They have it in swimwear though too. And it's 30% off swimwear right now. I like this one. Well, it's eyeballs, that matches the, the hoodie that I was just looking at. Oh. I didn't realize that Gap had Disney stuff. I feel like Disney stuff is everywhere. I think so. Well, we are in Orlando. Oh, yeah, yeah. So I asked this one time before, but is there is like Disney stuff this prevalent everywhere else? So everybody in those in the comments of that video were like, no. Okay. <laughs> yeah. That makes sense. All right. It's time to meet the Easter Bunny. There he is. There's the Easter Bunny, buddy. Do you see him? Are you already so excited to see the Easter Bunny? Look at that smile. Who is that, buddy? Is that the Easter Bunny? Wow! Look at the Easter Bunny dancing for you. Buddy, are you leaving? You're done? You don't want to see the Easter Bunny? Where are we going? Which one do you want to sit on, buddy? You want to touch the grass? Jackson's gonna paint the eggs. Oh no, his eyes were closed. Jackson's painting the egg. are getting all hiked up so these are his this is his birthday outfit from oh are you waving Hi. <laughs> this is his birthday outfit it's a little bit short the arms are a little bit short but we made it work right buddy did you see there's see a sabaro here i hear that's the most famous pizza restaurant in new york oh is it yeah. <laughs> michael scott visits there every time he goes to new york you, you know that that sabaro closed the one in Times Square? I can't imagine why. <laughs> so we just finished with the Easter Bunny, and then we saw that this store is gonna be opening soon. Psycho Bunny, opening soon, now hiring. What is that? Do you guys know? I've never heard of the Psycho Bunny. I like the artwork. We were walking by one of the stores and they said that people were trying to go in and they said, do you have an appointment? It was the Hermes store. Yeah, so I guess maybe some of these places you have to have an appointment to come into the store. Yeah, and it's funny though too. It's not funny, but it was interesting. A lot of the stores, um, the employees aren't wearing masks. Well, it was, yeah, which is strange. Super strange. So we were just walking by the Louis Vuitton store and they have like their mascot in the window. I love this guy. He looks awesome. He's next to the mannequin. Pretty sweet. What's his name? Louis Vuitton has the best window displays. Look at this cat sleeping in a banana. Louis Vuitton and 
Urs Fisher. And, uh, who's that? Oh. What is it? Louis Vuitton and Urs Fisher? Fisher? Yeah. Oh. I guess that's a designer. Okay. Also, it's really interesting it's to see. That. What do you I know. see? Also, it's really interesting to see which stores have lines around the mall. Like, uh, the Gucci store has a line, Louis Vuitton has a line, but like Chanel doesn't. Jackson, are you walking on the secret yeah. floor? What do you see? What do you see down there? Who's down what there? What do you see down there, bud? Fearless. Yeah, he really is. I can't believe he just like went right up to this clear glass. I don't know what it is about Jackson this age that he's in. Or he's going through a phase where he's like obsessed with steps. He just likes being up on top of things. <laughs> There's a store here that's just a personal stylist. And you could you could dress like uh, like this lady right here. Wearing your Tory Burch green outfit. Oh, dang, buddy, we should have gotten you this bunny cardigan. Oh, you would have been so adorable next to the Easter bunny. Maybe even like a nice hat. Actually, the outfit that he's wearing right now is from Janie and Jack. You're like a little Janie and Jack model. Oh, man, this reminds me of Jumanji. We should totally get something like this for the next time that we go to the beach. Oh, my goodness, they have an entire lobster table. Just all lobster stuff. Oh, I love the little overalls. Oh, my oh, you God. You can see them right here. That? And like it matches the hat. Oh, I love that. I feel like I got my ears pierced at, not at icing, but I did get it at the mall. I got it at the Piercing Pagoda. Oh yeah. That's where okay. I got my ears pierced. Yeah. All right, I think we're gonna try to eat lunch at the Capitol Grill. We got these lions outside. Lots of seating outside, so we should be okay. I hope it's open. That's also I saw people eating out here earlier. Ooh, they started us off with some bread and some salted butter. You playing peekaboo, buddy? Jackson? There he is. Where did he go? Oh, we switched him out of his clothes so he'd be a little bit more comfortable. So this is a shirt that we got at the um, the train museum. Yeah, in Winter Garden. Yeah, and it's so cute. It changes in the sun. Yeah, it's already changing. Look, buddy. You see your shirt's got colors on it now. What's on your shirt? What's on your shirt? Boop. We started off with a little field green salad that has a, what is it? It was a Parmesan vinaigrette. Uh. Ooh, it's very delicious. I've already had some. And mm -hmm. they put some fresh cracked pepper on it. All right, I'm going to do like a big reveal on my burger because this looks awesome. It didn't come with bacon, but I asked for bacon. And they're like, yeah, no problem. But there's like nothing with bacon on the menu, so I don't know where they got this bacon from. But it looks awesome. <laughs> oh, they said the bacon is normally for the salads. Oh. It's the lardon bacon. Ooh. I don't know what that hold means. Hold on, hold on. Oh, no, I got a straw in my ketchup. <laughs> and then I got some truffle fries. And then Jen got the sea bass with the miso butter and asparagus. And shiitake mushrooms. Who's on the phone? <laughs> hello. Hello. He's like. <laughs> He's like, hello. This is baby here. Hello. Oh, he like already knows how to hold it on his shoulder. And everything, so he can like. <laughs> Look, there he goes. Hello. Who's calling you? It's so funny because we like we don't use our phones like this. Oh right. Like, we text. We don't talk on the phone. <laughs> He's never seen us talk on the phone. Hi, buddy. Who's calling you? These french fries are so good. Tim took a bite of his burger and he literally goes, holy god, that's so good. This is the best burger I've ever had in Orlando. Is it? Uh-huh. Wow. Best yeah. burger? It was really good. Let me see. Show me the inside. Man, it looks pretty delicious. Oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> it's like umami. Everybody was getting mad at you for saying umami. <laughs> Why? I'm going to say it again. <laughs> umami. This is so good. It's sea bass. It's like a got a little crispy sear on the top, and it's just so tender. It's delicious, and the miso butter and the mushrooms like we we ate here on a whim. Like we've never eaten here, so we were like, oh, we'll try it. I am so glad that we did. Yeah. Delicious. So we just got home from the mall. And we noticed that one of our butterflies is a butterfly. One of our caterpillars became a butterfly. Yeah. Can you see him in there? And that's actually this one. Yeah. The one that fell. We'll have to, uh, can you get like a good look at the... I like the empty chrysalis? Yeah. I think so. It's kind of hard because the plastic is so like blurry. Right. Man, I wish we had gotten to see him like actually come out. Right, me too. Okay, let's let him go. You wanna see it, buddy? You ready? Here, he Here goes. it goes. You ready? <gasps> there it goes. That was your butterfly. He landed in the grass over there. Where did he go? Should we go look at him? Yeah. Let's go look at him, bud. I didn't see where he went. Come look. That's our butterfly. Right here, buddy. Can you don't see him? Get, don't get too close. He's don't gonna scare him. He's gonna go off into the wild. You see him? You don't even know what you're looking at. Right there, look. 
Okay. Yeah, that's yeah. butterfly. Okay. You see it? Right here. <laughs> what do you think? Okay. Well, that's a, your Crocs, I think. <laughs> okay. That's the butterfly. That's what we, we grew it. Bye, butterfly. I think you could say we grew it, right? We, yeah. Okay. We had a butterfly farm and we made a butterfly. He lives in that tree now. Old Tim Tracker had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. <laughs> and on this farm we grew butterflies. Well, on this farm we had a butterfly. <laughs> look at that shirt, These changed the color. Oh yeah, bud, look at how good your choo-choo shirt looks. There's two more in here that are also gonna become butterflies. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's, That's a, leaf. a leaf. I know, it kind of looks like a butterfly, doesn't it? It's another leaf. He only cares about leaves. You know what? He knows because yesterday we were out here playing mm -hmm. and that particular leaf he handed it to me and I okay. stuck it in my pocket and then when he wasn't looking at it, put it back okay. on the ground. He's like, Dad. And he's like, I thought you I thought you were going to say save that, that leaf for the rest of your life. Okay. So the other day we went over to Grandma's house and Grandma gave us this. Box full of clothes for Jackson. Um, oh, but we did get an air fryer and I wanted to know if anybody has any good recipes for the air fryer. It's not this air fryer, it's a different one, but uh, like, do you guys know of anything that's the best to cook in an air fryer? I wanted to show some of the stuff that we got for Jackson here, cause it's fun. Like this cardigan, he's like a, it's got like headphones on it. This is a raincoat that is uh, like a construction thing also. A lot of like fun outfits here. This one has like a cool dog wearing sunglasses on it. And then we got some, some books. He always likes these lift the flap type books. This one, oh, if you gave a mouse a cookie, classic. And then this, yes, my first lift the, lift the flap jokes. So you guys wanna hear some jokes? Why did the chicken cross the road? To get to the other slide. He's a playground aficionado and he loves slides. What do you call a sleeping bull? A bulldozer. That's a brilliant joke. I like that a lot. What's big and gray with horns? An elephant marching band. I've seen plenty of those. Where do astronauts keep their coffee cups? On flying saucers. What did the cat say when it struck out? Meow? Oh, that's kind of sad. I feel bad. He was like, oh no, meow? How do bees get to school? on a school buzz. Oh, here we go, all right. What dinosaur loves pancakes? A Triceratops. Brilliant, these are super fun. This is actually a book from a company called Highlights. And when we were kids, we used to get these Highlights magazines and they were always in the doctor's office and everything. It was like a magazine that helped promote reading. And I always used to love reading them because they were fun. Like they had jokes like this in them. Uh, and apparently, Highlights is still around and now you can, there's like apps for highlights and there's a club or like a subscription service for highlights where they send you like every month you get like a magazine, you get some books, you get about like some puzzles and things like that. Who knew that all of this had like progressed since I was a child. I thought that even if highlights was still around, it would just be like the magazine, like it was before. Now it's a whole thing, subscription service. So it's actually the next day and we need to go to Target. We have to do a quick target run. So? Yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> right, let's go. Buddy, do you love it in the target? I do too. Yeah, dance it out, buddy. Dance it out. Buddy, do you want? Oh, they have Lucky too. Do you want Lucky, Mackenzie, or Bluey? Or Bingo. Or Bingo. Oh, we found the big one. <laughs> All right. So I think, I think this will be the Bluey that we get. Should this be your Easter present? Look at him. He loves Bluey. No. He's hugging it. Oh my god. All right, so we'll do this. Okay, this is your Easter present. You're getting it early. I feel like there's no toddler that knows who the Red Hot Chili Peppers are. This is for Except for Jackson. <laughs> He's like, I know it. Oh, you just want the hanger. <laughs> Came down the Easter aisle just a few days before Easter. Sold out. Nothing left. Picked clean. Everything was on sale. Oh, geez, we missed our chance. You little silly Billy. Where's Daddy's nose? Where's Daddy's nose? Where's there Daddy's it is. Ears? Where are Daddy's ears? Yeah. <laughs> Where are Daddy's? Where's Daddy? Oh, the other ear. There it is. Where's Daddy's mouth? 
No, those are Jack. No, mouth. Where's my no? Those are my eyes. <laughs> where's my that's my eyes. Where's my mouth? Jackson, where's your mouth? That's your mouth. Yeah, you got it. No, those are your eyes. <laughs> where's we're my still, mouth? We're still working on it. All right, buddy. Let me see your shirt. Can I show everybody your cool shirt? What do we have on? It's your pterodactyl shirt, and they are hunting for Easter eggs. Yeah. So Jackson, do you know where Easter eggs come from? You don't. You don't? Well, what we have to do is we have to plant some Easter egg seeds outside, and then tomorrow morning, they'll turn into Easter eggs. Are you ready? You want to give it a try? Let's go plant our Easter egg seeds. All right, buddy, you ready? Here's an Easter egg seed. Now you put it in the grass right here. Just like this. You ready? Okay. Put it in the grass. No, no, no. Don't eat it. <laughs> Don't put it in the grass. There you go. Good job. Nice work. Here. All right. Here's okay. Another one. Let's go plant some over here. Come on. Here, let's plant some more. All right. There you go. Have another one. How about a blue one? All right, let's put it in the grass right here. Perfect. Oh, I love it. That's the perfect spot. That's the best spot. spot for it, though. Here, let's go plant another one. Okay. Here you go, right here. Right right in the bushes. Just like this. Nice work. There you go. That's good. All right. This was fun. I've never actually done this before. This is something we're going to do every year so we can, we can plant our Easter egg right, seeds. Put it right here, buddy. Put it in here. All right, let's see, buddy. Yeah. There you go. Oh, That's nice good. Nice work. work, buddy. High five. Yeah, high, high five. five, buddy. Oh, you want to plant some more? You okay. want to plant? Where do you want to plant that one? You want to put it in this one? Okay. Oh, nice job. Perfect. Oh, Yay. That's a perfect spot for your Easter egg. Take your seed. Oh, orange one. Okay, over here. Over here. Over here. Come on. Okay. Come on over here. I know, right here. What about right here, bud? Yeah. Oh, is that right? That's good too. You can do it there. Mm. And put it right here. Right here. Nice job. You want to do one more? Okay. Right here? Okay, yay! You did it! Okay. You know what we need to do now, buddy? We got to put out the bunny food. So yeah, the for the Easter bunny. bunny. You're gonna put out some carrots and bunny food for the Easter bunny? Let's do it. Let's put out some carrots and bunny food. We got this bunny bait from Target. And this will make sure that the, the Easter bunny stops at our house. He's like, but I really wanna eat it. It does look good. No, 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 let's. Okay, so let's see. You wanna pour some out on the bunny plate? Pour it out. How's that he pour it? Ooh, this looks just like what bunnies eat. <laughs> How's okay. that? Do you think that's enough bunny for the Easter bunny? I think so. And then should we give him a carrot? Yeah. You right. wanna give him a carrot? You don't you wanna go. give him a carrot? I'll put it right here on the plate. No. For the Easter bunny. <laughs> put it okay. right here on the plate. Alright, and then tomorrow morning we'll see if the Easter bunny ate it. Yeah. I know, you gotta leave it for the Easter bunny, okay? Alright, are you ready for Easter tomorrow? Look at him, he's like, no. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, it's bedtime, Mom and Dad. All right, buddy, okay. let's go to bed. So when you wake up, you can hunt for your Easter eggs. Yeah. Oh, I'm so excited. I feel like this is really just for us. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so That's excited sneaky. for you to see okay. everything tomorrow, buddy. That's a carrot for the Easter bunny. All right, we're going to see what he eats tomorrow, okay? Yeah. All right, everybody tell everybody good night and happy Easter. Good night. I love you. Say, I love you. Happy Easter. All right, so it's nighttime. <laughs> Think that I heard the Easter Bunny rustling around outside? I think so. So I think he may have hidden some eggs out there. Um, I just want to also quickly just thank. So we got that idea from the comments. Yeah. There were a couple of people. It was Caitlin Mitchell and Mountain Mama. Read your comments. I thought they were so cute. So that's something that I feel like we're gonna make a tradition in our house, just because it's fun. Yeah. It's it's. I think it's really cute. Yeah. They also said that you could. Um, Put lollipops like in the ground where the jelly beans were. Oh, okay. So like lollipops grew out of the ground. Gotcha. Yeah. When so, you say you could do that, what do you? Who, you mean the Easter Bunny? Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Gotcha. So, um, so thank you guys for leaving those comments. It was so super cute, and I just I think it'll be something cute that we'll do. And yeah. I think Jackson had a lot of fun. Yeah, I think so too. Yeah. He's like, I at first when I handed it to him, he's like. 
is this for me to eat? And I'm like, no, you got to plant it. He's like, oh, okay, let's do this. <laughs> yeah. So he was all about it. Yeah, it's a good time. Also, the pictures with the Easter Bunny, super cute. They were so adorable. Jackson did so good. I was actually really shocked that he wasn't scared. I thought he was going to be scared. Yeah. He he did great. And the Easter Bunny was fantastic. And I highly recommend, like, if you're going to the mall at Millennia, do their, like, holiday photo thing. Because they, yeah. they do pictures with Santa. Um, there's other stuff that they do, too. So we'll definitely be going back for that. Yeah. So, all in all, a fantastic day. Yeah. So, with that being said, we are off. We'll see you all tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price. Happy Easter. Happy Easter.